Welcome back once again. Now in this segment, we bring you the works of 20th century artist Gopal Ghosh, a true lover of flora and fauna, which is depicted beautifully in his art. Imagine an artist, teacher, a man who travels around India sketching, capturing all he sees. The intensity of Rajasthan's desert sun, the foliage of trees in the Chota Nagpur Plateau, landscapes that signify lush plains and humble people. Notice how he travels so freely between Western and Eastern art. This collection of works by Gopal Ghosh, some dating back to the 1950s and 60s, draw the viewer into the idea of creating a signature palette in the texture of nature's elements. Gopal Ghosh went way beyond uh, impressionism. Most works that you see in the present show or works that was his prime period of his artistic career which is uh, almost 10 years uh, between the 50s and 60s. Rustic Resonance, the name of this exhibition, features 58 hand-picked paintings of the Calcutta-born artist. Each study of the landscape is resplendent in strokes of feverish fervor. Take the earliest work in the suit 1936, the Marina Beach at Madras. A panoramic landscape that gives us a hint of the terrain that belonged to Madras. Ghosh strokes in watercolour generate movement and rhythm, creating a composition that is at once kinetic and still. Next, village huts from 1956, showcasing the vibrant colours of the sunset and sunrise, providing the viewer splash of hues that appear to blend the sun-tinted huts and the greenery that stands apart in its crimson certainty. These works were done in the 1950s and the 60s and we are looking at 2015. We are looking at a world that has been completely taken over by development and technology. Man and nature, there doesn't seem to be a relationship anymore. And I think the beauty of the show is that it is telling us that we need to go back to nature. We need to preserve it. Ghosh's landscapes here reveals much more than just his fascination with the imagination, the dream and the intangible. His sensitivity towards life, nature, people and the rustic settings set him apart. indeed was a magnificent display of nature and its beauty showcasing vividly the rustic settings with that it's time for me to wind up this particular episode we'll see you same time next week with the very latest on the cultural front until then take very good care of yourself it's a goodbye from the entire team <laughs>